Greetings, this is a Timeshare Traveler. Today I'm reviewing the two-bedroom at the Bay Club in Hilton, by Hilton Grand Vacations in Waikoloa, Hawaii, about 30 miles north of the airport. Um, I'm going to go through the room, um, the, the various grills and various things around the property. Uh, but before I do that, um, I'll tell you a little bit about my channel, and I also include some of the elite benefits you get as I'm an elite member with Hilton. Hi, this is Cliff and I'm the Timeshare Traveler. Welcome to my channel. The purpose of my channel is to educate those who love traveling in timeshares. I've been an owner, owner for 15 plus years at uh, Timeshare Ownership. I have elite ownership with Marriott, Hilton and Worldmark. I have a, published over 100 timeshare video reviews and I've published over 95 timeshare tips. I can be found on Facebook at Timeshare Trav, or Twitter Timeshare Trav, and on the web at www.timesharetraveler.com. We yeah, have the standard two bedroom at the Bay Club. I'm in building one. So when you first come in, this is the view you have. And if you turn to the left, they have this huge walk in closet, which is great um, for all this. So then you head on in just a little bit, and first thing to your left is the kitchen, which I love, the double sink, the nice large freezer and refrigerator combination. They have a separate five burner stove with your all your utilities, and have the microwave, and then the oven right below. So I like this setup, it's really quite nice. And then you've got your, right next to the kitchen, you also have the dryer and the washer combination. So it's a really nice setup. I really like that, um, the way it's set up. So um, the living room is huge here, but for let me first start with the uh, table for six. And it also has a couple people here. So while you're preparing dinner, you can have a conversation here. And then the living room opens up really quite nice. And you have a ceiling fan, keep things cool when you're not using the air conditioning. And I believe this comes out, I just didn't check. Yeah, this folds out and there's a queen size uh, living room sleeper sofa. Um, let me open up the deck if I can. The deck is super huge on this. So when you come out, you have a nice uh, table for four, and I like the fact they have two deck chairs. I'm on the first floor in building one, so the grills are at here, and then there's the golf course view, and actually you'll see sunsets just off in the distance. So it's got a really nice deck. It wraps around here. Actually, you can see into this one of the other bedrooms, so it's actually bigger, and you could bring more chairs out if you want. Going back in, let's head toward the master bedroom first. Um, and again, it's quite large, a king-size bed, open area, and a huge TV, I might add. Almost as big as the one in the living room. Um, here's one thing I've noticed and I really like. It has, it has like a platform on, on the closet, so that's really good for putting your suitcases, opening them up instead of having the little folding things that they have. Um, it also has storage for your towels and various things. And, and the vanity is a double uh, sink. And then you have a bathtub. And then you have a giant sh shower with an adjustable head so you can raise that up for someone like myself who's six foot six. And then you have a separate uh, toilet in here. And not to be outdone, there's even more storage here as well. And there's one of the little things you fold out to put your luggage on, but I'm going to use the racks, uh, just the built-in part. So that's the master bedroom. Let's go take a look at the second bedroom back through. So it's kind of nice. It's um, on a different section of the unit so you go from you know if the parents on one side I guess it's good or bad the kids are far away on the other side and the second bathroom here a single vanity 
toilet, the tub as well, and also a similar shower to the one in the master bedroom. But what I would say is nice is if you're coming with a family of four or six or five and having a shower and also a bath, if you have younger children, that would really work out well. And then the second be bedroom, which I really like this setup, is you've got the closet with a rack to store in, but you also have two double beds. So again, this would be, you know, more ideal suited for potentially old, slightly older kids. A nice TV, maybe two teenagers type thing um, in the second bedroom and they'd each have their own bed um, and so forth. And then you actually have back out looking at the deck again. So there you have it. This is the Bay Club by Hilton Grand Vacations, a two bedroom, the basic two bedroom um, in Waikoloa, Hawaii, about 30 miles north of the uh, Kona Airport. When staying at the Bay Club, you also have access to the Kahala Suites uh, main pool, which is right here. Got the little fountains for the kids, a couple of nice little water slides. Up on the top there is a hot tub. And they have a couple grills here. And a bar. And up here, they have a fairly good sized hot tub. So, again, um, this is the, technically the Koala Suites pool, but it's available for those people staying at the Bay Club. One of the two main pool areas at the Bay Club, it comes with grills, which right now it's open here. They're cleaning it. Um, but there's the other grill over here. That's a little bit... Here's what they look like. So they're really thick grills and they have quite a complicated Dealing, so you can even cook over and keep a warm plate over here. And then there's sort of the kid pool here. And this is the larger main pool. Plenty of nice seating. And what seems to be is you don't have to reserve those ones with the hoods over. They're just available first come, first serve. And here's a look at the pool. And they're also changing areas, areas in shower facilities. And it looks out onto the golf course. And that's one of the main, one of the two pools at the Health and Grand Vacations Bay Club. Here's the second pool at the Bay Club. A little deeper, one of the two pools, six feet deep. Plenty of places to sit around. And there, back here is a place to lounge and there's a shit bar that opens up later in the day. And then there's the hot tub right here. And head on down to another set of grills that are being cleaned. Plenty of places to sit. And you can enjoy sort of a, it's a bit of a, a man-made river. You can see that water fall from there and over there and sort of cut out of the rock level. Fitness center at the Bay Club. Plenty of machines. Oh. And then what I like best is they actually have a good set of, of the uh, life fitness machines here. And then you have kind of the everything else machine and some free weights. They also have a, a quiet area here, but it's right next to the tennis courts. And at the end of the tennis court, they have a basketball hoop. So if you're into playing basketball, you can sort of have a half court game. Elite members at Hilton Grand Vacations get access to the Kingsland properties. So I'll hear some videos of the pools at the Kingsland that you have access to.
I'm going to do a walkabout of the Kingsland swimming pool, starting at sort of with the uh, basketball goal, volleyball net, plenty of places to shoot around the pool. And then they have a little beach area for kids right here, and a small tiny water slide. And they have these walk bridges that you can walk from pool to pool. And this one walks you over to the pool. And here you can see another water slide. So plenty of places for kids to play. And there you can see another water slide. And now we're kind of into the main family pool. And there's a water slide there as well. And lots of waterfalls. You can swim under actually. Um, or around. And here's one of the first hot tubs. There's two that I know of. There's one hot tub. And again, these are available when you're staying at uh, Waikoloa as, uh, sorry, Bay Club. Um, as an elite member, you get to come here and use these tools. So it really adds a lot to the sort of experience, okay? Now we're coming up to the adult pool. And again, plenty of places to sit around. And I'm going across the bridge. You can see this one main pool here. And there's a cool hot tub hidden in a monks that people are using. But my favorite part is just a little further up. Here's the hot tub. And then the last thing, which is my favorite, is you have this waterfall right here. And you can actually get to it by swimming underneath the bridge. And you come out the other side right here. And there you have it. This is the main pool at King's Land, which is available as an elite member when staying at the um, Bay Club by Hilton Grand Vacation. Hope you enjoyed the tour. I by Building 25 is kind of a, I guess I would call it a kid pool. We do have a hot tub. Um, but there's a lot of fish and plenty of places to sit for the kind of cool, smaller pool. Or there's another pool, smaller, again, with a hot tub over in the corner where the kids are playing there. Plenty of places to sit here. What's a little unique is that it, this is the only one that I've noticed that actually has uh, grills next to the pool. So there's one on this end right here, very similar to other grills, but um, um, and one on the other end. So it's kind of nice to have a poolside grill where you can have sort of the kids playing and then uh, you doing the grilling while that's going on. The almost 4,500 points translates into about $150 a night when I look at my maintenance fees, which is a great deal for a wonderful, huge two-bedroom in the Waikoloa area.